Hello, today we are going to be talking about uh, some ways that uh, you can find a best paying freight out there. Right now it's very hard to find such freight, but here are some tips that might help you with that. So as always, I will start right away and uh, we'll go straight to the point. So the first thing that you can do if you are trying to book the best paying loads out there is to start early start early no matter what time zone you're in i suggest uh, seven or even earlier but seven is uh, optimal that's when there is uh, more freight out there than usual usually and uh, that's when uh, the most dispatchers are not working so if you start early uh, you will be able to maybe cover some freight uh, ahead of others and then also you may be able to look some better paying loads and then also stay late i'm not saying you should uh, work for 14 hours a, a day but you know sometimes we actually do uh, but stay late if most dispatchers are working till uh, 5 p.m you can stay even later because there are other brokers that are on other uh, time zones and uh, maybe maybe they just want to go home and cover their freight for tomorrow or someone uh, maybe cancel the load for that same day or they just want someone that's picking up early. So uh, start early and stay late. Uh, my next tip is uh, to try and use uh, chat GPT, try to use uh, artificial intelligence and I'll show you what I mean by that. Chat GPT has a free version. So if you copy these loads, you can uh, select them all or, or you can go to edit and then select all and you will select all these and then you can just copy them and paste them into uh, chat GPT. So uh, for example, what I did uh, here is uh, I uh, selected uh, a whole week ahead and I asked ChatGPT to uh, uh, plan my uh, trips for the next week, all right? So I uh, provided uh, ChatGPT with all those loads uh, within a 450 mile radius uh, from Dallas and I asked, uh, hey, plan my trip for this week and then uh, it gave me all the loads and it made all these connections and it routed them all. And uh, it's, uh, for example, like here in Dallas, Texas, it wanted me to go to Victoria, Texas. Uh, and then this is the rate, this is the broker. It has even the phone number, broker score, distance, uh, equipment, everything. And it planned the whole week for me. Uh, and then I asked, uh, like, the, here's a total revenue, average rate per mile, all of that, which is really cool. And I said, hey, give me the summary of uh, all the expenses. And it gave me the total revenue, the total distance, uh, fuel efficiency, fuel price, uh, how much the driver pays, uh, everything, uh, tolls, uh, you name it. And then I, I went even further. I said, hey, find me a truck stop along this way to rest every night with good food and clean bathrooms and uh, cheapest diesel prices. Gave me all the uh, truck stops where I can rest as a driver and, and find the cheapest fuel and what you can also do uh, is you can analyze uh, the freight uh, you can say hey uh, let me copy all these loads here and then uh, just ask chat gpt to analyze and give me uh, the best uh, paying loads okay so uh, let's just uh, do edit and select all and we're gonna copy this text and just say hey uh, give me the most profitable loads from this list and then you paste everything press enter and then uh, it will help you uh, find the most profitable loads okay so here's a load to bronx uh, marion indiana to state college eighteen hundred dollars and with all the broker information so that's another way what you do is you make a search you copy everything, paste it into ChatGPT, and then it will analyze these loads and give you uh, some uh, suggestions if you don't know uh, what to do. Uh, it can also uh, do another thing. Uh, you can go to uh, markets here, uh, market conditions, 
and uh, you can take a screenshot and uh, you can just paste that picture in chat GPT and uh, it uh, will tell you where the best areas are to send your truck. So uh, let's say we, we want to do a reefer and then I'm just going to uh, make a screenshot here. Here we go. And uh, I'm going to paste it. Uh, market ring. Now it wants me to send the truck to Miami, but let's just say, hey, uh, I don't want to go to Florida. Yeah, this is not bad. I mean, like send your truck to Miami. If not, then send it to Chicago, Dallas, Atlanta, Georgia. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Another thing is uh, you can post trucks. Instead of going to search trucks, post trucks. Uh, that way brokers will see your trucks and they will call you. And then usually if they call you, uh, you have an upper hand in the negotiating by the rates because they need you. And uh, in my opinion, they will usually not call you and offer you a stupid load, something very cheap of uh, something out of ordinary. Usually they will uh, offer you a, a good paying load and a decent load. Another thing you can do is uh, keep contacts of uh, whenever you book a nice paying load, then keep contacts. Uh, ask those, hey, tell me when you have this uh, load next, or I do have a driver there tomorrow or in three days. Uh, please uh, let me know if you have another one of these loads. You can add these brokers to your uh, G chat. You can talk to them. Um, in uh, gchat and uh, if you see a load from that same uh, broker or posted you can just ask this guy directly say hey i see you guys have this load can you help me out and then uh, another thing that you can do is uh, never stop watching never stop trucking uh, hopefully these tips were uh, helpful to you and uh, that little trick with chat gpt uh, I don't know how much you can use that uh, for real, but it's it's a nice thing to know and it's a cool thing to show you what it can do. Thanks for watching and then I'll see you guys.